Okay, hello and welcome back to another review. So today I'm going to be doing a review of the game Agavania. So this is another game that I recently received a review code for. So I'm going to be checking it out and giving my thoughts and opinions on it in this video. Um, I've already played a little bit of it, so I'm going to be um, showing what I've played. Uh, let's go straight into this. So, as you can see, this is the main character. And this is kind of a 2D platformer, F2, retro style game. And obviously you just have to get from the start to the finish. Obviously make sure you don't die. You have a sword as well, yeah, and you can just put projectiles with it, kill enemies. So they get enough lead A ranking. Let's go on to the next one. So yeah, you need to collect these lost souls. Uh, I've got to do better at dodging the projectiles. I'm getting hit by them. Oh no, I timed that really badly. Do it this time. There you go. Yeah. So yeah, as you can see, you could do like wall, wall bounce as well. That's one of the lost souls. Okay, so looks like we've got to go this way for now, and then can't yet proceed past there. That might be the end of the level, maybe. But Okay, that's the second lost soul. That's the third one. Okay, so you just need to get across here. Door is open. There we go, that's level 2 complete. Oh, bad. Oh, come on. Well, at least I got through the level. I don't know where we're going here, so I've got three lost souls like normal. Ah, uh, okay, this is some kind of key. That I'm sure will be useful. Ah. Uh, that's one lost soul. Two. So we have a key and two lost souls already, which is pretty good. Uh, okay, let's go down and up. 
Watch out for enemies. Do not like the look of that guy, he's producing enemies. Uh, it's pretty concerning. Yeah, let's just get the above him. Doors open. Okay, we've got B this time. That's a little bit better. Did it in just under two minutes. On to level four. And up we go. So we can get a boss there. I want to see what's down here. Actually, no, no, no. Yeah. This takes us back to the beginning to see how this is away. Okay, need to keep it out. Let's go up here. Okay, I am um, missing a lot. Oh, okay, yeah, we can go up here then. Oh, oh. that was close. Ouch! Don't do this to me. That side took too much damage. Go, 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 go. So, I need to best us jump that go. Door open. And we're through. Why am I getting seen again? Why is this happening? Okay. Next level. Okay, this level seems more open. So, okay, so there's a door there. Can't get past. Yeah. new abilities in the store that help you in your journey. Okay. Am I able to buy new abilities here? New abilities sounds very useful. Ooh, okay, so let's wait then. I keep thinking that guy's gonna turn. Like, if he was actually intelligent, the guy would actually turn. This is actually a little awkward position because of the spikes. Yeah, there you go. Well, I dealt with him regardless, so it's fine. We need one more um, spirit thing, which should be this way, yep. Sheesh, I was not meant to do that. That was a big... Oh, whoa, there's a huge slime over there. Door is open. 
instead of, let's just avoid them though. Yeah, I need to be super careful. Why aren't there any more? I wish there were more heart containers. I think if you have a gem, you can restart from a checkpoint instead of restarting the whole level if you die. Oh, that was it for the level, okay. Spirit found, yes. I found the spirit and they still got a seed. It's really sad. So, um, anyway, I hope that I've given you like a taster for this game. So, as you can see, I played through the first uh, five levels. I'm also going to, in fact, before I end this video, I'm going to show you. I know one of the extra abilities, so as you can see, this is the ability shop. So there's more depth to the game as well because you can get extra abilities, you get extra heart, double jump. I don't know which one would be most useful at this point in the game. Um, double jump is really useful, so is dash. I mean, a bow could be really extra heart. I think probably an extra heart would make quite a big difference. Okay. And as you can see, in total, there's 20 levels. I've shown you um, a course of levels in this game. So I hope that you like Look at Mangavania. As you can see, it's a really entertaining um, 2D platformer. Um, it has quite... It, I think that the levels are well designed, and there's depth to it as well, and the fact that you can buy different abilities to help you become just more powerful overall. In the, so... I definitely recommend this to you if you are a fan of like retro style 2D platformers. Um, that's a lot less revelating. 2D platformers are just less common among AAA titles, so I think that if you um, want to obviously a game that's going to be kind of like nostalgic and retro i think this is definitely going to be for you um definitely um enjoy my time with this game um and i hope that you enjoyed watching me play for it in this video so that's going to be all for now all for my review and um i'll be back very soon with my um dream